Well, it looks like the first Seeker Rare for Darkwing Blast is here, and uh, I love name changes, man. Make sure you guys smash the living crap out of that subscribe button so you guys don't miss out more awesome content. We have the world, well, the ultra rare, as we would say here, for the Darkwing Blast. Now, what's very interesting about this is we got a name change here, and I'm not really sure what Konami's doing here. It's now Muck Racker from the Underworld. Um, it's two effect monsters to make this. Formerly was Reporter from the Underworld. Konami used the link material. The Turner just link summon. Every monster monsters you control will be destroyed by battle or card effect. And should be one fiend monster you control instead. That's pretty good effect. Self-replacement effects generally end up pretty good. You can target one fiend monster in your graveyard, except for Muckracker from the Underworld. Discard one card, and if you do, special summon that monster. Also, you can special summon for the rest of this turn, except for fiend monsters. You can only use this effect of Muckracker from the Underworld once per turn. First of all, facilitating um, advantage engines here for the Dark World package that's coming out. Hey, you know that Dark World structure deck that you're not going to see until December this year? Well, this actually ends up being one of the coolest cards for it, because you get the ability to target a fiend, discard a card, and special summon it. It's on a pretty generic link, too. That's like the first thing that I'm very happy about here was Konami did a good job in terms of card design, you know, locking it between two effect monsters. A thousand attack, I'm not the super happiest about, but also wrapped in on this, you've got a self-replacement effect as well. Um, generically, I've seen this card come up a decent amount in the OCG. It is something that they do actually play. So if you're sitting out here wondering about this going, you know, does this card really have an application in play? The answer is yes, it does, all right? So much like all of the other cards that they make into the sneak peek slot here, they actually end up being a secret rare. So thanks, Konami, for confirming the fact that our first secret rare is going to be Muckracker from the Underworld. I'm not entirely too happy with that name change, if you want me to be perfectly honest with you, but I guess, nonetheless, we should be happy that we're getting this. I guess this confirms the fact that we're not going to have a really cool goatee card in the set if they're doing this, or unless their plans for this being the all ultra rare slot here was we can have more copies of this in circulation because Konami's expecting this to be one of those cards that's going to be very sought after with the Dark World Structure deck. I don't know. That seems to be the logic here when they do these types of things, but nonetheless, all right, sure, I'll take it. So what do you guys think? Please leave a comment down below, tell me what you guys think, and I'll see your beautiful faces back here later on in the day, guys. Peace. Patrons, thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. Check out these other videos.